Hi, in this video you are going to be estimating measures using customary units. There are two systems of measurement, the customary and metric, and in this lesson you are going to be focusing on the customary system. Specifically, the customary units of length from smallest to largest are the inch, foot, and yard. Let's move on to your first question. Which customary unit of length would you use to measure a DVD case? The height of a DVD case is a small measurement, so feet or yards would be too large. That means you could measure it using inches. Now that you know you would measure it using inches, you need to estimate the length of a DVD case. So you need to choose whether the length of a DVD case is A, 8 inches, B, 25 inches, or C, 3 feet and it will help if you imagine placing it against a piece of paper as you see here. Here's the DVD case and here's your piece of paper. And this piece of paper is about 11 inches. So you would estimate that the length of a DVD case is A, 8 inches, as you see here as well. Let's move on to your next question. Which customary unit of length would you use to measure a basketball hoop? The height of a professional basketball hoop is too big to measure using inches. Is a basketball hoop smaller than you? No, it's not. A basketball hoop is definitely taller than you. So you could measure it using the larger unit, yards. And a baseball bat is about one yard. So now estimate the height of a basketball hoop by thinking about how many baseball bats you can place along its height. Then you'll be able to answer this question. The height of a professional basketball hoop is either A, 15 inches, B, 3 feet, or C, 4 yards. As you can see in this image, you can place about 4 baseball bats along the height of the basketball hoop. So, the basketball hoop is estimated to be about 4 yards high, or C. In this video, you learned how to estimate the length of objects using customary units.